Does this make it look cooler? I don't know. <laughs> it's gonna look so cute on one of you. I know it, I know it. Okay, we're gonna try on the skinny jeans now. <laughs> and so I don't even know if I'm gonna cut these. <laughs> the wall was closer than I thought it was. And so I'm going to show you this denim jacket. How do I do this? Hold on. This is the one of a kind. I only made one of these, the Jesus Loves You sweatshirt. Hi, this is Katie. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you the second half to my clothing, spring cleaning, decluttering, all of that. I ended up posting two extra videos this week because with all of my spring cleaning, I just ended up filming a lot. I was just spring cleaning a ton. On uh, Tuesday, I posted spring cleaning all of my skincare and everything in the bathroom. Wednesday, I was spring cleaning all my makeup and I got rid of a lot of my makeup. And then yesterday's video, I went through my closet and any clothes that I was not wearing anymore or didn't fit me or whatever, I either put in a maybe pile that I'm gonna be trying on in today's video and or I put in like a pile that I knew I was gonna be giving away and or selling. And so that was yesterday's video where I went through my closet, but in today's video, I'm gonna be trying on the clothes that I'm gonna be selling and some of the clothes in like my maybe pile. And so I'm gonna decide in this video what I'm keeping and what I'm selling and or giving away. And then I'm also gonna show you a couple new pieces that I purchased recently. And so yeah, I am gonna look different in the rest of the video because I'm filming this a lot later because again, all this footage which is so much that instead of two videos, I just decided to cut it into four. And so some of the outros and some of the intros on these videos, I'm just filming on a different day because I just realized after the fact that I needed to film a new intro for this video. And so yeah, I really hope that you're excited for this video, trying on some clothes, and that's all this video is gonna be. And also, if you wanna purchase anything that I am selling, I will have the link to my Poshmark below in the description. But uh, yeah, all right, I guess that's it for this intro, so I hope that you guys enjoy this video. This is just, that black like scoop neck tank top. I think this is cute. I know I was questioning it before, but I think I'm probably gonna keep this. Uh, let me try on another t-shirt. I'm gonna go pretty quickly. I usually can't snap, but that kind of sounded like a snap actually. That was probably really loud, I'm so sorry. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're gonna go through this quickly. So I think I'm gonna keep this. I think, I think so. Okay, here's that white cropped t-shirt that I think is from Target as well. Like I said, I have some issues with white tops now. Uh, not every white top, I still like a couple of mine, but most of them I don't like. And I think I really only wanna keep one white t-shirt and I don't think this is it. I don't think this is it. I don't think it's bad, I don't think it's bad. I just don't think it's gonna be my favorite out of the few. I'll try on the other two after this so we can compare. I, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna keep this one. Mm -mm. I think we can do better with the next ones. Okay, this is the Aritzia white t-shirt. This material is really nice. It's like really thick, a little bit more structured, but this one is a tiny bit shorter than the Uniqlo one that I'm gonna try on next. And so like if I tuck this one in, like it's gonna come up if I start dancing or something, you know? And so this is more of like a not tuck it in shirt. And so I don't know, I don't know. Uh, yeah, I, you know what? We're gonna try on the next one and we'll compare them, but I think I'm actually gonna end up keeping the Uniqlo one because I can tuck that one in. This is a nice t-shirt, it's a nice t-shirt, but again, I just don't want really more than one white t-shirt. So let's try on the Uniqlo one next. Okay, here's the Uniqlo one. Again, it's just maybe like an inch or two longer, but if I wanted to tuck it in and do this, it's not going to untuck. And honestly, this shirt is so similar to the Aritzia, again, except for that it's a little bit longer, but the material and the fit are so similar, but this was like half the price of the Aritzia one. I think the Aritzia one was like 40, and this was, I actually don't remember, but I would guess around the 20-ish. It was definitely cheaper than the other one. But yeah, like the material's nice, it's pretty thick. I'll probably end up keeping this one. What do we think? Imagine it's all tucked in. Usually I would do that. Hmm. Okay, I was hoping that like adding a bunch of necklaces might help with these kind of more basic t-shirts to see if it elevates it a little bit, you know? But I don't know, I don't know. I'm also looking at the tiniest little viewfinder. <laughs> and so in editing, um, I'm gonna be able to like really make more of a decision, you know? But I think I'll probably end up keeping this one and selling the other two, I think. Okay, I think we have a couple more tops and then I'll try on all the bottoms. Okay, so this is the top that I recently got and I really liked it when I got it and now I'm like, ah, I don't know. Every time I've worn it, I've been like, eh, I'm not sure. But I just wanna try it on with like more necklaces, more jewelry. 
and see if that makes me like it a little bit more. Because honestly, I am a t-shirt and jeans kind of girl or t-shirt and shorts kind of girl. But again, I just want a little bit more elevated than that. Some of my clothes are not gonna be t-shirts and jeans, but even if I am wearing t-shirts and jeans, I want it to look a little bit nicer. You know what I mean? Like I don't want it to look like I just rolled out of bed, I guess. And so that's why sometimes jewelry can help with that. But I just don't know if it's that it's a plain t-shirt and maybe it's this color and something's just a little bit off. Or if when I add jewelry, it does make it look a little bit, I don't know, just like a little bit more put together, a tiny bit. Obviously it's still an oversized t-shirt, but just like a tiny bit. What are we thinking? Do we like this color with my skin tone is the question. Or does it make me look like frumpy? That's what I really don't want. I do not want to look frumpy. So, okay, but I also wanted to try it on with like a little vest. Mm. This is gonna weird me out how like bunchy it is. And I would not wear this as an outfit, okay? Imagine different pants or shorts or something, but just look from, look at me from here up. <laughs> uh, like, does this make it look cooler? I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't feel great here. Um, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. Again, because I have a lot of oversized t-shirts already, but I think I just prefer ones that have graphics on them. This shirt is a maybe. Okay, one more shirt, the flower shirt, the flower shirt. Okay, 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 okay. I have had this shirt for years. I think it's so cute. I just think it would be cuter on someone else, I think. Again, and like, cause it's so different than the rest of my style, I don't see myself reaching for it. Literally the last year or two, I don't even know if I've worn it at all. It's really cute though. It's stretchy in the back. It's easy to put on, easy, easy-ish to put on cause this is very structured. But look how cute it is. It's so cute. I just, obviously your style can be whatever you want it to be, right? But since it's so different than my style, I literally just don't reach for it. I don't know, unless like, am I gonna become a floral girl? I don't see that happening. I just don't see that happening. It's so cute though. But this just might be up on my Poshmark right now. Yeah, I think we're gonna put it on my Poshmark. So I think the only things that we're keeping so far are the black tank top and the white Uniqlo shirt. And this is going in the the no pile. It's gonna look so cute on one of you. I know it, I know it, I know it. And I think it is cute. I just think it'll look cuter on you. Okay, all right, so now I'm gonna put on a different t-shirt cause now I'm gonna try on all the pants. And um, I think some of them would look extra funny with this. So like, I still wanna give them a chance, you know what I mean? So I'm just gonna put on one of the t-shirts. Okay, so I just put on the Uniqlo t-shirt. Uh, these are those ripped jeans. I like my jeans baggy, but these are way too baggy. These are way too big on me, like way too big. So I'm not even gonna consider ripped or not, whatever. It's just literally, they do not fit me. They're way too big on me now. So I'm gonna put these up on my Poshmark. I don't know if you can see the whole pant, <laughs> but uh, yeah, they're just way too big on me. So Poshmark time. Okay, we're gonna try on the skinny jeans now. <laughs> Uh, yeah, skinny jeans, here's the thing, they fit me. They fit me, can you see like my ankles? <laughs> they fit me, I just don't like how they feel <laughs> and I don't think I'm gonna wear them anytime soon. Anytime soon. It's one of those things, like if I thought I was gonna wear them in six months, I might keep them because it's kind of hard to find skinny jeans that fit, you know, but I just do not see myself wearing these. They feel so weird. <laughs> like they're cute, they're cute, they fit, whatever, but. Yeah, these are gonna go up on my Poshmark as well. Okay, here are those like comfy pants and they are too big, but they're not too, too big. You know what I mean? Like they stay up at least, but I just don't see myself wearing these. Like they're comfy, but again, it's like, I don't know. I'm not loving tight things around my ankles, except leggings are fine. So I don't know what the difference is, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I just don't see myself wearing these. I haven't been wearing them. And so I'm going to either put these on Poshmark or just give them to Goodwill. Okay, again, I am totally fine if certain pants and stuff are baggy, but these are like too big and too baggy. And I also already have like three other pairs of hiking shorts that fit me a little bit better. Um, like black hiking shorts that fit me better. So I'm going to either give these away or put them on Poshmark as well. Yeah, they're just a little big and I have other ones I like better. Okay, so these are the black Old Navy shorts that I actually already cut and I really like them. I like them that they're, you know, an inch or two shorter. And I'm just keeping both sizes and I cut both of them. And so now I have more black shorts. Okay, two more pairs. 
Okay, so I know I said it earlier, I'm not the biggest fan of light denim anymore, but there's a couple shades of light denim that I still like, and I like this shade of light denim. And again, these are baggy, but in a way that I like. I like it, and I think if I style it right, they'll still be cute. And so I don't even know if I'm gonna cut these. <laughs> the wall was closer than I thought it was. I don't even know if I'm gonna cut these. I might not. I don't know yet, but I am gonna keep them for sure. Last pair of shorts. Again, these are big and baggy, but I kind of like them like that. And I think if I style them correctly and I tuck in my shirt and all that stuff, I think that they can still look cute. And again, on these, I don't know if I'm gonna cut them. I'm not sure yet. I don't know, but I am gonna keep them. Okay, so now let me show you a couple of the things that I'm definitely giving away, just like show you them on really quickly. And so I'm going to show you this denim jacket. How do I do this? Hold on. So this will be on my Poshmark. Again, it's from The Gap. I only got it like a couple years ago, but again, I just am not loving this color right now. So I figured that I would just sell it. Hopefully one of you guys will love it. Um, and again, this is a size medium and I'm generally an extra small. So this is just what it looks like on me. I would say honestly for a medium, the arms are a little short. So if you're looking for like really, really oversized or really long arms, this might not be it. But if you want it to fit like this, and you're my size, or you wanna fit a little bit smaller or something, this might be good. Okay, so that's what this looks like. Let me show you the two like little sweatshirts. Okay, this is that H&M little teddy sweater. Very cute, very cute color. Again, I'm just not wearing it. I have not worn it in a while. Even though it's warm here, I still wear sweatshirts. I just haven't been reaching for this one. So I figured I would just let it go. Yeah, it's cute. It's like a little close up. It's cute and it's cozy. Okay, one more. Okay, and this is the last one. Again, this is the one of a kind. I only made one of these, the Jesus Loves You sweatshirt. And the main reason that I did not sell these in the past is because when I got this sample, this is a little bit lower than I wanted it to be, but working with their customer service and trying to figure it out honestly was kind of a nightmare. And so I was just like, never mind, never mind. I'm just gonna sell a t-shirt because my sample of the t-shirt was perfect. But yeah, so it's a little bit lower than I would have wanted. But besides that, just a good sweatshirt. Um, again, I just don't love this color, so I haven't been wearing it. This is what it looks like on. Again, I'm 95% positive this is a medium. And so this is what it looks like on me. And it hits like right below my hips. Okay, so I'm also gonna have this on my Poshmark as well. So now let me try on the couple things that I got from Mango and TJ Maxx. But also first I'm gonna put the air conditioning on lower because <laughs> it's warm in here. Um, but then I'll try on the outfit that I got from Mango first. Okay, so these are the shorts and the top that I got from Mango. And I'm just wearing them as an outfit because honestly I would wear this as an outfit. I'd probably put a belt on and all oh, my necklaces probably put a belt on and maybe I wouldn't wear my hiking sandals with this. So you guys know I wear them 90% of the time, but I do have other sandals that I might wear with this. But yeah, again, basic, basic tank top and shorts. But I just think that the fit and the cut are a tiny bit more elevated, a little bit more of what I'm looking for. And so this shirt is just a black tank top. I think it was like $19.99. I think it was only $20 for this tank top at Mango. And what I like about it is that it has like this really wide strap at the top and the end of it is textured. I don't know if you can see that. It's a little textured, but again, just a tiny bit more elevated than just a regular black tank top. And then these shorts, I just think they fit really well. Again, I have a lot of baggy shorts and these are a little bit more fitted. And I think the cut is nice. I think they fit nice. They're not too short, but again, they're also not too long and baggy, which again, I like, but just to have one more kind of different pair. So again, I would wear this as an outfit, probably as is with a belt and just some nice sandals. I almost fell again into the wall. <laughs> and these shorts were $49.99, I believe. And if I can find these pieces online, I did get them recently. So if I can find them online, I will have them linked. But yeah, this is the first outfit, which again, I know is very basic. I think it's just a little bit more elevated. So I like this a lot. Okay, and now the next outfit I'm gonna try on is from TJ Maxx. I don't think you've ever seen me in something like this before, but I love it so much. And again, it is just more elevated than what I'm used to, but I still think it's within my style, if that makes sense. So it's just, just get ready, just get ready. Okay, so this is a little linen two-piece set from TJ Maxx. You guys, guess how much this was? I bought them separately, but guess how much it was total? Just guess, I'll give you a second. 
this whole set was $40. $20 for the top, $20 for the shorts. And so yeah, just like an off-white little vest. I love this neckline. And the linen shorts that are pretty long, I would say like Bermuda shorts. I just think this is so classy. If I can style it right, again, with like, I'm trying to think what shoes I'd wear with this. I don't know, I don't know yet. It's Rachel Zoe, by the way, both pieces, obviously, it's a set. Um, but yeah, I just think it's so cute. And the top is in a size two. I could have gone for a zero, but they didn't have a zero. And the shorts are in a size two, and the back is a little stretchy, but the front is like a zipper and a little, not a button, but like a, a hook kind of thing. So yeah, how cute is this? Okay, I did get another vest from Rachel Zoe. Should I just try it on with these shorts, I guess? Yeah, I'll just do that. Okay, no, you know what? I'd probably wear this with denim, but this does look cute. But let me try it on with the mango denim shorts because I think I'd probably wear it more like that. But this is so cute, but hold on, hold on. Okay, so again, I'm not really sure if I'd wear these necklaces or whatever, but at least like this part of the outfit, I think I'd wear together. So another Rachel Zoe vest in a different color, obviously, and a different cut. Also a size two, could have also done a size zero, but they didn't have it but I think the color is so pretty. This is similar to that t-shirt color, I think, but yeah, it might just depend on the cut and whatever, I don't know. I don't think the air is kicking in and I feel like my mood, uh, sometimes when it's hot, I get really hyper and sometimes when it's hot, I'm like, <laughs> and right now I'm like this. So I'm sorry if my mood seems low. I don't know what is coming across in camera. Anyway, hi, hello, okay. So anyway, vest, size two. This one was $25. I don't know why the price was $5 more than the other vest, but whatever. I still think that's a great price for this, like a great price. And I just, again, think it's like a little bit more elevated. How many times can I say that? Just a little bit more elevated again with these shorts and just a nice pair of sandals or something or like little nude heels maybe. I think this is so cute. And I did go to TJ Maxx recently and get these things. And so they might still have them at your TJ Maxx if you wanna go look, but I doubt I can link these because it's TJ Maxx and you can't really link things usually. But uh, yeah, again, linen-ish like mix material or linen blend material. I think it's very cute. So here's all the clothes that I need to take pictures of, put on Poshmark, get a giveaway pile, do some laundry. This is everything I'm getting rid of, which is really exciting. Like I did really get rid of everything that I was not wearing and that I didn't love. Yeah, so now I just have to take the pictures and put them online. So again, I'm gonna have everything linked on my Poshmark. If you're curious, if you're interested in buying anything, I'll have it all linked below. And yeah, I guess that's just gonna be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed hanging out with me, doing a little bit more spring cleaning. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that you're subscribed for some videos like this where I'm hanging out at the house, but also a bunch of vlogs, some like little day trips, and I talk about food on Sundays. And yeah, I guess it's gonna be it. Thanks again for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day. I love you, Jesus loves you, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.